<laughs> Welcome back to Drowning in Walls. Drowning your sorrows. I'm gonna do a backflip. Okay. Whoa. Uh, you just disappeared. It's hiding. Alright, 100 red coins. Here we go. Pole dancing for red coins. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Mario loves pole dancing. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, so I guess I'll start by collecting all the coins near the bank. Looks at the camera, wiggles eyebrows, winks, smiles. L O L O L O L. Uh, nudge, nudge, poke, poke, prod, prod. I think that might be it. I was gonna say, I think that was it. Okay. Let's go deeper. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, it's the vortex. I, I don't. The vortex. I don't like this. I don't want to be here. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Sharks. Oh jeez, Wario, can't you just give me some gold coins? No! <laughs> I think Mario and Wario aren't friends at this point. Hmm. So I think uh, Wario's only appearances have been like weird cameos and Mario Land. Where Wario's like... Oh hey, uh, cousin, I heard <laughs> you got a castle! <laughs> it's mine now! <laughs> okay then. Because I guess Mario was super rich from his adventures in Mario Bros. 1, 2, 3. Well, I guess not 2, because that one's like implied to be a dream. Oh, well maybe Lost Levels then? Lost Levels and um, also Mario Land for Game Boy. Mm. So, so I guess Mario, bored with his little shack, bought a castle. And then Wario stole it. I haven't beaten Mario Land 2, so I don't know what happens to the castle. Like if Mario gets it back, or if it's destroyed in the adventure, or mm. what. Mm. Well, it does seem kind of rude of Wario either way. Yeah. I mean... Would you want your cousin to steal your house? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I yeah. read somewhere, or heard somewhere, that Wario is Mario's cousin, but... I don't know if that's, like, the official canon, canon right yeah. now. Yeah, yeah, I'm not sure either. I remember that being, like, the theory. Yeah, a lot of people, people theorize said. that Wario and Waluigi are brothers, but that's never been confirmed. Yeah, it's kind of weird. Nintendo um, has commented on other, like, assumed familial Oh, like the Koopalings. Yeah, where people assumed that the Koopalings were Bowser's children. And, yes, and yeah. to be fair, that is the canon in the co uh, the, the cartoon, cartoon that was in North America. So I can see why people would think that, because it seems like an official source is saying, yeah, these are Bowser's kids, but the creators of the characters are like, what? No. No, that was never the case. <laughs> They're just Koopalings. Like. <laughs> They're powerful Koopas. Yeah. They're all related, but not necessarily related to Bowser. Hmm. I used to love uh, getting the camera in here. For some reason, there's like something mystifying about having the camera inside of something very tight like that. Hmm. I don't know. I'm drunk. <laughs> don't mind me. I'm so it's one of those things when like video games were more, I guess, mysterious, and and being able to kind of manipulate them felt really cool. Yeah, I'm way more goal orientated than I used to be. Yeah, like. <laughs> It's gonna sound bad, but a lot of the time when I played video games as a kid, I really was just, like, fucking around. I wasn't really trying to beat the game. Yeah. Like, I'd run around Clock Town for, like, three days and then watch the world end. <laughs> like, <laughs> in Majora's Mask. Yeah, in Majora's Mask. Like, I, I wouldn't actually, like, go to the temples or anything. <laughs> well, that's why when we play Majora's Mask together, usually I'm just doing all the out-of-town stuff and... Yeah. <laughs> You're like, oh, new transformation. Yeah. It makes this side quest a little easier. Yeah, I like that about that game. But, but yeah, I guess as an adult, and also having been exposed to more people explaining how video games work and like showing the back end of stuff, it oh, doesn't yeah, really seem so like... Pull the curtain. Yeah, it just doesn't seem so 
mysterious and like, ooh, you're gonna find all these secrets. It's kind of, I kind of more understand that yeah, it's like, somebody had to program it in a certain for way. For so long, people are like, oh, Luigi's in the game. And I was like, no, I've game sharked the hell out of this. I've dug through all the program. Yeah, there's no, there's no evidence of Luigi. There's evidence that maybe they were thinking about having a second player because the game detects a controller 2's inputs. Hmm. Interesting. But there's no, like, model of Luigi. There's no... Weird. Like, I wonder what Luigi they were... Luigi life counter. There's nothing Luigi. Yeah, they obviously decided that they couldn't do it, or... Oops, that was too late. Yeah. There's evidence of, like, Yoshi, though. Like, um, I know Yoshi appears at the very end of the game, and he gives you lives, but, uh, there's, like, a sprite for his egg and stuff. Oh, weird. Yeah. That could have just been that they were thinking of having him be in an egg that you Yeah, open. that's possible that he's, like, trapped in an egg until you get all the stars. Yeah. Who knows, right? Yeah, it's hard to say. Or it's possible that they might have taken inspiration from, like, Super Mario World, where when you defeat Bowser, you rescue a Yoshi egg. Oh, yeah. I feel like that would have been a very different... Um, different feel. Yeah, a different feel, because it right now, the goal is to save Peach. Well, I kind of enjoy how simple it is. There's only three characters, really. There's Mario... Peach and Toad. And Bowser. Yeah, and then there's Bowser as well. Well, I guess there's the bad guys. Through extension, there's Lakitu. Yeah, you don't see Lakitu very often, though. It's easy to forget that he's there. Lakitu is just a really creative way of explaining how the camera works. Yeah, which, for the first time that you actually had a camera that you were controlling, it makes sense that they would need to kind of address that, or that they would want to anyway. Um, to make it easier for people to understand. Yeah. Like, you, you're not just gonna be seeing everything from top down or, like, one direction. One direction? <laughs> what is that? It's... What? Like, what do you mean? <laughs> it's one direction, not two. Not two, not three, not five. One direction. Oh, snap. Seven. There's only one red coin left, and it's going to trigger both stars. Hey, Nice. That's what we like. Yeah, it's on this one pole. I didn't ride for long enough. Mm, gotta go pole dancing again. Yeah. I feel like I have to be so careful on these. Yeah? This pole. This pool. This one. And that away. Yeah, when I stopped for the blue coins, I kind of neglected to get that one coin. Bro! Yeah? My name is Brosif. But you can call me Brosifina. My name is Brody. I'm gonna call you Rob. Freaking rude. <laughs> I'm gonna call you Orb. Okay. <gasps> but which is the real one? <laughs> Trick question, they're both real. Here we go! I know, I'll collect the red... Oh, you collected 70 power stars. The mystery of the endless stairs is solved, thanks to you. We didn't even look at the endless stairs. And Bowser stairs. was ever upset. Now to the final bout. Mario's like, what the fuck are you talking about? Who is talking? What endless stairs? Yeah, who is talking? Maybe it was Lakitu. I doubt it. Well, maybe he has like a headset and he's connected to all the toads in the walls and he gets the news of what's going on yeah. to pass on to you. Just a little bit of immersion breaking, having <laughs> like a narrator, I guess. Yeah. Oh. I didn't pull off my double jump. Mario thing. hit his head, drowned. <laughs> End of the adventure. Yeah. At least you solved the endless stairs. Yeah, great. This is like before toads were proving themselves as like capable. Yeah, that's interesting. I hadn't really thought of that. 
Toads have really come a long way in the Mario series. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I believe that is level done. Nice. Yes, it is. Now, there's actually two levels on the main floor that I never completed. Oh. Yeah, you said you were going to come back for them when it was more convenient. Yeah. One of them is a the ghost? Yeah. Because I need to vanish cap. Oh, uh, spoopy. <gasps> oh, you missed. There we go. Back flip, forward flip, forward, forward flip. <laughs> also while gaining air. Da -da -da. This game is about mad ups. So much ups. Up, up. What? 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 Okay, so getting the last star is very simple. Okay. All I gotta do is have some fun. I got a feeling those books want some lunch. Yeah, they looked pretty hungry. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Use the special power to get onto the balcony. Whoa. And then I go through this painting of a boo. What? And I reveal a giant eyeball. Then I dizzy mode it. Wow. Yep. So you can't get in there with something invisible. That's correct. Here we go. That boo is just not sure what to do with his life. <laughs> He's like, well, I almost got Mario, but I didn't. All right, now that level is complete. Excellent. So there's just one more level I gotta complete, and then we can go upstairs. Up. Where all the best levels are. Oh. I can think of two. Oh, that's that's more than zero. There's the clock one, and there's the rainbow carpet. Yeah, I, I might just do those to get them. <laughs> there's also oh, that the mountain giant snowland. Where you're sometimes big, sometimes small. Yeah. That's the mountain. Uh, no, no, the mountain has the monkeys. Oh. Okay. What's the sometimes big, sometimes small? I would describe that as like Goombas and the Wiggler. There's Goombas, yeah. Giant Piranhas, Koopa the Quick hangs out there. So what is that one? I'm not clear what your question is. What level is it? It's not the mountain, it's not, like what would you call it? What is it called? Giant Small World? Giant Small World, okay. <laughs> I don't know, like, it is kind of a mountain, but it's... The other mountain is just so much more mountain. Yeah. I just wasn't sure what the level was called. Uh, like, I literally don't know what it's called. <laughs> big Small World. Possibly. Big Small World? I don't know. I'll, I'll get back to you on that. Okay. I, do, I don't have a good answer right now. What the heck, me Neil? Minutes, I'll You've think played this game really. like 40 times. <laughs> What's the level name? You know, it's not one of my favorites. Not to say that I dislike it. It's just not one that interests <laughs> me a whole lot. I just remember playing it with you on the multiplayer hack. No, oh, it was hard, because the log wouldn't <sighs> respond to Luigi. Yeah. <laughs> so, there's a part where you have to go on a log and, like, run to there. make it move? I believe I have every possible star before going upstairs. That's good. So we're at 73. Here we go. Here we go. Click. Could you imagine being so short that you had to jump oh, to turn a key? Oh, God. <laughs> I mean, the world would not be made for you, that's for sure. Okay, so there's Wet Dry World. Uh, that one's got the carpet, so that's the frozen one. This is the mountain. Mm. Tall Tall Mountain, I think it's called. Okay, yeah. And, uh, yeah, I have no idea what this level's called. Big Small World or something. Hmm. And yeah, Wet Dry Land, I like that one a lot. But it's a water level. Hmm. Yeah, you don't like water in real life, but in video games, you're all up on. It's pilot controls. <laughs> her hamster is making a lot of noise in her little cardboard house. Hey, buddy. There's something strange about that clock. As you jump inside, watch the position of the big hand. 
Oh, look what I found. Here, Mario, catch. Okay, so that's an example of them giving you information. Yeah. That people probably mostly don't read, right? Like, most people probably don't talk to the toads. But even so, that was still pretty cryptic. Like, it gave you a hint. Yeah, but if you hadn't played the level yet, you probably wouldn't remember that comment. Yeah. That's the hamster. We're not under attack. Or Thanks, anything. Mario. The castle is recovering its energy as you retrieve power stones, and you chase Bowser right out of here onto some area ahead. Oh, by the by, are you collecting coins? Special stars appear when you collect 100 coins in each of the 15 courses. Nice. You want, you want to do this one? Okay. Thanks to the power of the stars, life is returning to the castle. Please, Mario, castle. you have to give Bowser the boot. Here, let me tell you a little something about the castle. In the room with the mirrors, look carefully for anything that's not reflected in the mirror. When you go to the water town, you can flood it with a high jump into the painting. Oh, by the way, look what I found. You found a fucking star. That's like the third one that a toad gave you? Yeah. That's crazy. You toads, you're alright. <laughs> you you toads are alright. <laughs> you didn't give me stars though. Fuck you. So I think I'm at 13 <laughs> secret stars. 12! 12! Which one did you miss? Oh. Secrets and lies. So many lies. Oh, oh come on. Me. Okay. You, you alright? I'm okay, yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Next time on Scrolltastic, we're gonna figure out what's making this light. Mm. Maybe it's grandma.